Who, who are you? I'm you. But I look like I'm made out of Play-Doh. Hey guys, it's LPS Honey and I just want to say quickly thank you all for the awesome support on my most recent videos. I'm really glad you guys are enjoying them and I've been working a lot on different projects like short films, skits and of course LPS Love Hurts. So thank you all so much for being really patient with me and I hope you will enjoy future videos. But today, let's get on with this video. Hey guys, so today I was very lucky to find another Littlest Pet Shop magazine at my local news agents. And if some of you don't know what I'm talking about, you may want to watch the first video I did on the LBS magazines and there'll be a link up there. And yeah, you can go check it out if you want. Now, when I first got the magazine, I was actually pretty impressed with it. And even though the LPS you got with it for free was kind of weird, it was still pretty cool and something really awesome to own that's LPS related. But oh my gosh, what is that? Okay, let's have a closer look. So here's a look at the newest edition of the LPS magazine. You get four free gifts, a pet toy, a notebook and two stampers. In this pack you get the rabbit called Vanilla. And down here is the little notebook and little stamps. You can't really see that. Ah, there we go. Apparently inside the magazine you can also make a miniature rabbit hut and I am so excited to see what it looks like. Now surprisingly I actually have the official version of the rabbit that you get inside this pack so I can do a proper comparison compared to last time because I didn't have the official cat. But this time I do, so yay! So here she is and I actually really like this rabbit. I think the G5 rabbit mold is very very cute. So we're going to open up this magazine and compare the free rabbit to the actual rabbit you can buy in stores. But before we do that, let's have a quick look at the magazine. Here's our free little bunny rabbit. The illustration looks adorable as usual. But I have mixed feelings about the actual pet you get. So here's the magazine. It's kind of boring, but I really like the colours. And speaking of magazines... Is this the Style Paws magazine featuring an exclusive interview with yours truly? What? But yeah, I was interviewed for Style Paws magazine and they did a whole interview with me, which was crazy and there's also lots of photography, articles, tips about filming, information about LPSCon, just yeah a lot of cool stuff so um, I'm not getting paid or anything to talk about this. I bought this with my own money and I just thought it would be cool to show you guys so if you're interested in buying one or if you just want to learn more information about Style Pose magazine and see some other LPS tubers get interviewed, I'll leave a link to their Instagram in the description below. So yeah, thank you so much everyone from Style Pose magazine for interviewing me. It was really awesome and uh, yeah, selfless promotion over. Let's get back into the magazine. Alrighty, so I'm just going to go through this quickly. So first page we of course have the bunny hut which I will definitely make on video. I really do want to make this one and I still need to make the car from the last magazine. So we have some pet quizzes, some spot the difference, a maze, um, colouring in and then all of the magazines I believe have a comic in them which looks pretty cute. It's all sweet themed. I really like the look of this one. Um, kind of like Where's Wally, I guess, or Where's Waldo, whatever you want to call it. A poster, some more puzzles, um, ooh, okay, uh, bunny rabbit cupcakes. Those look adorable, oh my goodness. I want to make them. Um, Sudoku, more coloring in, a board game, I think. <laughs> Um, a little kind of solve the story, I guess. Oh, okay, this is like my favorite part. Even though I can't enter these because I get this like too late and the competitions aren't valid anymore, you could win this pack. <gasps> uh, 
and they have blind bags and then of course they have the little oh what's it called um, shuttle bus that's it so yeah they do competitions in here which is really cool some more spot the difference um, and then this section here is where you can draw your own LPS pictures of the characters from the show I think they might be like redoing the magazine to have the new characters in it because these are the old characters and if your one gets chosen you get to win the moose pack which is probably one of my favorite double packs they have come out with recently I just think they're so adorable and then at the back we have some advertisement for their other magazine and then more cutouts for the little bunny rabbit hut the only thing I don't like about these is that I have to cut the magazine apart to do it so yeah but I will definitely do this in the future so there's the magazine now I would like to just take a moment to compare the paid for LPS to the free LPS now I think it's really cool that Hasbro gives out free LPS with these magazines even though they aren't proper LPS and they're more like LPS little statues or figurines they're still really cool especially for people who can't really find LPS where they live but they can get the magazine and as much as I really like the cat I got last time some of them look a little freaky like the bunny I'm about to show you so I just quickly need to open this up my gosh this looks like it's made out of cake icing alrighty so here's our little free bunny and she's pretty much just like the cat she's made out of the same hard plastic and yeah you cannot move her head she has a dark pink nose with uh, blue eyes pink on her chest and uh, the same dark pink in her ears I like that they use the same colors like throughout oh and a little pink tail okay that's actually pretty cute and here is our always adorable real LPS or proper released LPS whatever you want to call it so the main differences are this one is bigger and the face is slightly different and also the nose and ears are a lighter color so let's do a side-by-side -side comparison da -na -na, ta -da! yeah there's really no competition here the official LPS this one right here is 10 times better in my opinion I think this one does look pretty cute but when you compare it to the real one it's like oh my gosh what are you but like I said it's a good option for people who can't get proper LPS where they live and I think it is pretty cute it's just not as good as a proper LPS and I do like being able to bobble their heads around and everything like that and I think the eyes are a lot better painted like these ones are really small and far apart where these ones have big cute eyes and they're like the perfect amount apart I guess so let me know in the comments down below which one you prefer and do you like the magazine bunny I think it's not the best but not the worst and I do really like the fact that they both have little adorable bunny tails like oh my goodness and I just realized this one is kind of more like purpley pink where this one's like definitely pink so yeah so there we go guys I hope you enjoyed this video and yeah I hope it wasn't too short or anything like that and I've been meaning to do this for a while I just haven't had the time so I'm really happy that I could finally film it for you guys and show you like a comparison between the two bunnies and um, yeah, like I said, a link to Style Paws Magazine's Instagram will be in the description below. Um, so definitely go check them out. Oh, and I almost forgot one more thing. A quick little update. If you watched my Teensy video recently, you would have seen that I wanted this little bell Teensy with a baby cow in it. And I went to the shops today and I was like, uh, I'll buy one and if I get it, I get it. If I don't, I don't. And I really wish I was filming when I opened it because I got one of the cowbells. Ah! So I got the purple one, which wasn't the main one I wanted, but I actually really, really love this one. And I think I prefer it to the yellow one. Oh my gosh. Look at him. He is adorable. He's like vanilla, chocolate and strawberry all in one. Look at his little horns. Oh my gosh, it's adorable! Okay, yeah, sorry about that. I just thought I'd let you guys know that I finally got the little baby cow and it's so cute. But yeah, anyways. So, 
Like always, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, don't forget to like, comment, and of course subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye guys. Helicopter Y. A notebook and two stamps. And also, oh my gosh, I dropped my mascot. Ha ha ha.